this is just a quick video about my Turag, which has been having some electrical issues over the last few years. Basically, every time I went to drive it, the batteries were would be flat, even after long drives. So I had a look at the issue, and around the car, testing front and rear batteries, there was pretty much no current charging the batteries. However, there was decent voltage. I uh, tested the alternator, found there was 14 volts coming off the alternator, or close to 14, and there was massive battery um, cable loss. Uh, the OBD was also th showing 13 volts, um, which is interesting because the dash was showing 14, so it took a while to figure out where the dash gets its voltage reading from, which is obviously the alternator. It doesn't use the ECU or anything to give it that. The alternator is below, I think that's a fuel cooler on top of the engine, so you have to take off the oil filter and the oil filter um, housing to get to that cable there, which you can see is a bit stuffed. Um, so it's pretty easy to get those items out of the way without um, causing too much of an issue. Um, and then there's the bolt which holds the old cable um, into the alternator. So you're looking at the back of the alternator down the bottom there. Uh, after replacing the cable straight away, you can see good voltage to the battery posts in the engine. Um, the new cable goes over the top of the engine just because it was easier and I didn't have a longer cable in the shed at the time. Uh, it's only a five dollar cable or something um, and you can see now the front battery is getting good charge and the rear battery was also getting good charge um, and hopefully all the problems are solved